Okay, this is my last video. I think I did about three or four videos. <coughs> but if you don't kill the flesh, the flesh will kill you. And we talk about discipline mindset. Um, you want your mind to be transformed. You want your mind to be renewed. All that good stuff. We don't want to give into the flesh your desires. I know the Bible says he'll give you the desires of your heart, but your desires have to line up with his will. See, when you have the spirit of God, then your desires change because the spirit of God is in you is what's changing you. So the things you used to desire are not the things you desire no more because your mind has been renewed through the spirit of God. So what you used to desire, you don't desire no more. So that's why he says, I give you the desires of your heart. It's because your desire has changed. You don't have the same desires and passions you used to you had before you came to Christ. So that's what that means. Um, but you want your mind to be renewed. You want to think soberly. And it's very, very important. I'll leave you with this last scripture. Probably got about 40 seconds. Um, but it says, so a man thinketh in his heart, so is he. So you become what's in your heart. So if your heart, if you've been heartbroken, if you if you have toxic stuff, pain, whatever, whatever's in your heart is can affect where you're going. If you don't deal with what's in your heart, if you don't heal from what's in your heart, if you don't forgive the people that hurt you from the heart, then the things in your heart can affect where you're going. So you'll become toxic. If you have toxic in your heart, you'll become that because your thinking pattern will, will, will flow with what's in your heart. For the Bible says the issue of life, your issues, your pain, your struggles, it flows from the heart. So that's why it's good to confess and deal with the things in your heart. Allow God to heal you. Allow God to restore you. Um, if you don't kill the flesh, the flesh will kill you. So allow God to renew your mind through the word, through praying, through fasting, the things of God. God bless you. Hope this helped you. This short, um, three, four short videos.